Dude, those airplanes are both looking exactly the same. Are they like a flight school or something? Yeah, they're probably doing training. They're doing touch and goes. Oh, so this is a shorter runway? Yep. Yeah. So yeah, you got a shorter runway. You got to get up there. Sound up clear for takeoff. I'll watch it. You're up. <laughs> That's what I do. Yeah, I know, right? You had great, you had great manifold pressure over there. I know for being this high. Yeah. What's the DA right now? Uh, three thousand one hundred approximately. Right there, three thousand six hundred. Oh, three thousand. Look, I'm doing a thousand feet a minute. Wow. Oh wow. All right, left turn, one pop, sir. So that aqueduct, that's our uh, canal. Where's it coming from and going to? So there's there's a reservoir way back that way. Uh -huh. All right, look at one pop, sir. Where was he? You said? Uh, I don't know. Do you see him here? Uh, right oh, there. I can look on here. Mine. Mine. See right there? Oh, uh, okay. I'll turn. When do you pull reduce power? Um, I'm sorry, I'm going to do it right now. So he's over there. He's oh, 400 yeah, yeah. feet below. Oh, wow. There's a guy right there. Do you see him? Oh, wow. Four yeah. o'clock. All right, one pop, sir. Wait. No, that's not the helicopter, is it? No, not a helicopter. It's an airplane. Well, he sorry. said there was a helicopter to our one o'clock. Do, do you see him? Uh-uh. I'm looking. I got it. You got him? Yep. One pop, sir. It's a helicopter. It's like... Sure to go. One pop's here. Roger. Free change. Free change. Boom. One pop's here. Ah, just leave it. Do you want to fly? I love flying. Alright, your plane. My plane. We could just stay here for now because I want to take you over uh, this mesa that's over oh, okay. here. We can go low. Where the heck is. Uh, 122.75. What's my, or do you have an altitude restriction? Yeah, we'll just stay, we'll stay low. We'll stay here. You can switch seats if you want, uh, Marshall. Thanks. So I live out off of our, our left wing here, down that way. You can, you can put this in your logbook, PA32, uh, <laughs> do a uh, so Piper Okay. We'll go to the left of these, or actually you can go to the right of them, and we'll go around that way. All right, I'm gonna adjust your trim a little bit. Oh yeah, yeah. Is that yeah, okay? Yeah. Your plane. Plane, right? So we'll go around that way. <laughs> so we're gonna go over a place called New River. Okay. Arizona, and they're known, at least I know them, for a nudist colony. No way! Yeah, so, I don't know, Marshall, do you want the, do you want the binoculars? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Totally. Get some boobies. Yeah, <laughs> so we took a motorcycle ride there with my son, and, uh, and they, I'll, just, I'll fix the, you can't see the ball. No, I can't see it. Yeah. And it's all, it's gross. It's, it's the place is, uh, it's called Shangri-La. 
Okay, so there's somebody. What oh, what what altitude is that? So we're at three thousand three hundred. Oh, what altitude he's at? Yeah, yeah. Twenty seven hundred. Wow, I don't think we ever I've ever gone this fast. <laughs> 156 over the ground, indicating one. What is that? 150? What the heck? That's awesome. Wow. Good day to fly. Yeah. We're more. So we'll go. We'll go up there. See how that? It's all flat up there. You mean to go that way? Yeah. That's good. I would have never thought I'd get to fly while I was out here. See? Did you get to fly Sarah? Sarah. The same as yours? Like you feel the same or? It does, it does. It feels about the same. Yeah. I got it, you know, like the gear, I, I mean, that it's just like a, yeah, I normally put the gear up. Yeah. You don't do that, but otherwise, yeah. it's the same. Look how big those power lines are. Yeah. Oh, you see them, so stay away from them, right? <laughs> <laughs> They're way down there. Well, normally, I'll like when it's a day like today that we we're early enough that we could go low like we are now. I'll actually go 50 feet off the ground. You fly, do it. Huh? Yeah, you're yeah. yeah. That's gonna be awesome. Maybe I won't do 50, maybe 100. I mean, these, this is just so beautiful, like this terrain, you know? Yeah. What do you think, Marshall? It's pretty cool. Like, see, there's like a power line or something up here, you know? Oh, here, like, yeah. power. So that's what we have to watch, and that's what I'm more concerned about is in these uh, power lines. There's, yeah, what are those things? Like, fences or, yeah, what are those? Like, little I don't know poles what just sticking up. Yeah, there's, like, yeah, that's exactly what uh, no, yeah. Then you got something over there. Yeah. But it's neat though, right? Oh, it's amazing. You know, when I was flying up here, without last time I was up here, I was way more like like I was like I was higher, right? Yeah. Because I didn't know the area, and I and I just wanted to make sure I was being cautious. But it's so fun with you, you know the area. <laughs> you off. Wow. Look at this. Now we're in that valley. Wow. But it's like you're going into the Grand Canyon here. <laughs> You've flown the Grand Canyon, right? Yeah. Yeah. And I can touch the ground. I can jump out of the airplane right now and still survive. <laughs> you think so? I don't know, Marshall. It probably hurt. I uh, hurt a little bit. My dad had skydivers jump out of this plane like that. Oh, really? Yeah. I mean, I can see the leaves. Out of a P-32? Yeah. Do you see any uh, elk or anything? Oh, okay. Is there elk up here? Is yeah. Is kind of hot for them? No, this is, we'll go and chase them around. And... Whoa. Look at this, look at this thing. Huh? Wow. That's so cool. Beautiful. Yeah, well, so the rest of the day I have this big, huge 
grin on my face. So there's something down there, but it looks like a cow. Oh yeah, there's, there's a lot of cows, so I think that's a cow. cattle, but you'll see elk and, and then... And deer and stuff. Yeah. Oh yeah, those are cows, for sure. Yeah. Now we're a little higher. We'll go towards... Uh, the lake. We could do the lake, or we could go towards... Oh, I see the lake. Yeah, you see it? Yeah. We can fly over that if you want. That's pretty neat. So we used to fly into Colorado when I was a kid, and you're like this because the mountains are so high, you're close to them. And I used to love looking for the herds of elk, you know? And, yeah. And you see them, you go, oh my gosh, yeah, there they are. I'm going to take you... I mean, I guess the lake is, is cool. We could go that way. Oh, you can go wherever. I'm, you know. Yeah. My saying is, people are like, where are we going to go? I go, a mile of road takes you a mile, a mile of runway will take you anywhere. <laughs> <laughs> There's all these roads that go up in the mountains. Yeah. I, guess, I guess people go take trips. Yeah. So I just did one, um, took a road like that, up a little, just a little north of here. Never been there before, and it's 27 miles of dirt road. Really? It ends up to this restaurant. Company is Blue Skies Insurance Group, and my tag is we insure everything under and in the sky. So we do anything. I can insure anything. Wow, this is so beautiful. Isn't it cool? Right. This is where this is where everybody spends a whole day or a week. So on. what's the name of the lake? It's called Lake Pleasant. Oh, Lake Pleasant. I mean, it's beautiful. Yeah. If you ever get a chance to to rent like a boat or go to Sorora Lake, it's, it's actually even. I think Sorora Lake is more beautiful. That you're in like like in a valley, mountainside. You know, it's just. You're in awe when you're on the, wow. like you go around a little boat. And... Yeah, look at this. Isn't that cool? That's so cool. I guess like, uh, is the lake like down or are these like little big no, islands? That it's probably up, up because we've gotten a lot of rain, but I don't, I don't, I'm thinking it would be up just because of the rain we got. So Arizona dealing with a drought like California, right? No. But Arizona technically is always in a drought. Right? Yeah. <laughs> so, you know, and I've never, growing up, like I said, in Connecticut for 42 years, I've never seen more green than here. Like everybody waters everything you know? else. Like there's no water shortage here. I remember growing up one time they had a water short shortage in Connecticut. In Connecticut? Yeah, they're like, oh, we can't use water. Like, like you know, the drought in California. But, but people, people, uh, but what happens with Arizona, and the reason why I, I love Arizona is because it's so opposite of the East Coast. It's brown, it's, you know, mountains. I thought I had mountains. We, we had hills, right? But what happens is people want to move here because they like that it's sunny every day. And then they want to bring what they had at, at Illinois or in Connecticut. They, they want to bring that here. So they start planting grass and they start planting oh, trees. Right, yeah. So growing up, I always heard that Arizona was a place to go if you had allergies. You come out here yeah. and it, it, like asthma and stuff. Uh -huh. But now it's not like that. Like I'm constantly like allergic to something out here because wow. people are bringing in their stupid stuff from wherever state they were at before, you know? And it's just interesting, like I, I have friends that go, it's raining, I love the rain. I go, then go move to Seattle or go move back to New York. Like, oh, oh, look at this dam. Yeah, dam. Watch your language. I know. So if you go up north, you go through the Hoover Dam. Oh, wow. And you go uh, to ATC, just now like to sightsee the dam. All right, when you get closer, you're going to 
we're gonna switch you over to the damp frequency. <laughs> it's, it's literally. If you look on the if you look on the chart, it's a damp frequency. And then you could go. I said, what? Uh, when I switch over, I said, is there any restriction? They said, nope. Uh, Ever, you know? The dust devil. Yeah, dust devil. All right, so I see this feeds that aqueduct, and that aqueduct goes into the city. Yeah, wait, this one does? Lake Pleasant? Well, I just, yeah, I'm looking at an aqueduct right there that's going into the city. Northeast, uh, northwest. Got him. Yep. There. You actually see him? Yeah. Right there. Below us, or? Like right even with us. Yeah. About. Leslie's a hawk. I know, how do you see that? I don't see it. Are we, we're, we're behind them though, right? Oh yeah, 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 he's not back here, but he's right here. Yeah, but I wish I could see it. <laughs> Check Angelo, get your eyes. Oh right no, there. my eyes are bad. <laughs> oh, there he is. Now yeah, I see him. I told yeah. you. Oh, I know. I, I trust you. I, I just <laughs> wanted to see it. I have great vision. My vision I guess is so. like, uh, like 2013. Wow. It's good for dentistry, but I yeah. still use magnification so that I can, like, you know, see like, uh, like tenths of microns uh, when I'm working with people. Now we slow it down. We got a headwind now? I guess. Uh, oh, oh what, which airport is that? That's Sky Ranch. Sky uh, Ranch. Oh, you're... Scottsdale's right there. That where? dome, that, that, that's where Westworld, that's kind of where we were yesterday. There's like a dome oh. uh, to our like one o'clock. So, you know, even if you flew into Phoenix, that's the airspace that doesn't start until 7,000 feet, yeah. so you're good. Uh, so, that's where Scottsdale Airport is there. Okay. We were eating somewhere around here. Okay. Uh, that's like Desert Ridge area where you guys are staying, is like th this area here. This is Pinnacle Peak, that peak right there. Uh, is Pinnacle Peak. So, this is, this is, uh, this golf course and oh wow that's this is his own personal golf course and you can see that's his house right there that's not a clubhouse that's oh his my house God. wait that big thing on the far left there yeah so it's like two hour 11 o'clock oh yeah wow here whoa Man, he's got to have people that, okay, there are oh, people yeah. on the course. Oh, no, his house is back there. That's oh. the clubhouse. That's his house over there. Jeez. It's still gargantuan. Oh, yeah. Golf course is he? Yeah. Well, again, that's, that's his own private golf course. Is that a fountain? What's that Oh, yeah. There? So, oh, uh, perfect. I was going to see what time it is. So, that's Fountain Hills. So the guy that the, that did that development, he also did out west of here in Lake Havasu, Arizona. He brought oh, over yeah, like he Havasu. brought over the London Bridge, not the whole bridge, but he brought a section over. Oh, wow. So that Lake Havasu has the London Bridge, and Fountain Hills has this fountain. It's the world's largest fountain. Oh, I'm so glad you guys wanted to go flying. This is oh, like, yeah? Do you have fun too? Oh, I I never. Tired of it. Especially doing this and it's so smooth. Oh, yes. Yeah. You know, I think you're right. You know, I like flying around Birmingham, and you know what's fun? When I go up with another pilot, I get to sight see. Oh, yeah, yeah. And so that's what's fun about, like, you know, you letting you. Yeah. I mean, it's amazing. Oh, wow. Look at that. Cool, look at that. Wow. Fountain Hills is such a great. Wow, look at that. That's a great picture. Oh, yeah. Grab it with the wing. 
So we're the only one that's doing this right now in the world. <laughs> so is that like a real expensive place to live? Yeah, but not as expensive as Scottsdale. So then you come back around over these mountains and go. Yeah, we're going to try oh. Scottsdale Tower, Saratoga 301 pops here. Saratoga 301 pops here, Scottsdale Tower. 301 pops here, we're. Uh, Nine and a half miles to the east at 3,200. I'd like to transition your airspace for Deer Valley. Number 301, Pop Sierra, Scottsdale Tower, transition approved at above 3,000, Scottsdale Tower, 2983. 2983, at or above 3,000, uh, approved, one Pop Sierra. At or above 3,000. At or above 3,000, one Pop Sierra. Didn't I say that? Southroom 18, Bravo, traffic to the right side, about a mile northbound, Cessna, I'll see busy 3,500 climbing, contact Phoenix departure. So you could probably see... Pilot right, form over departure, 18, Bravo, ticker. Falcon yeah. or Gateway. 840, mm -hmm. extend down, I'll call the base. Extended. What's that called? Uh, you'll see the Scottsdale Airport. You can barely see it because it's... I don't see it right now. Because it's... You see the tower. Oh, uh, I do see it. I see it. I see it. Yeah, yeah. Runway 21 is... Traffic 12 o'clock and 3 miles, transitioning westbound after basic 3400. They're talking about you. Okay, continuing, Terry 18. Good morning, Scottsdale Tower, laser 577 Tango, just off Deer Valley, 3000 feet, with the transition... Oh, I live right off of our right wing. That whole area is called McDowell Mountain Ranch. Right, 362412. See an apartment complex. There and then reporting. Oh wow, yeah, there's 818 traffic no factor on a 2 1 clear to land. Clear to land on a 2 1 here at 18. This is where I had to go around because the wind was coming where I clear custom. Somebody is going to sign an app to see the. Dear Valley Tower, Saratoga 3 is 1 pop, sir. Saratoga 3 1 3 0 1 pop, dear Dear Valley Tower. 301 pops here, we're uh, 5 to the uh, east, uh, 3200, full stop, Charlie. 301 pops here, you're about to take park north. North park, one pops here. 301 pops here, Roger, make the left traffic runway south left. You'll be number two on a helicopter, join the midfield downwind from the south. Left traffic, uh, number two for some left, one pops here. 301 pops here, traffic follows short funnel, here number one now, runway seven, uh, left third to land. Alright, some left clear to land, one pops here. the helicopter. Yeah. I see the helicopter. Oh. Is that your third notch? Second. Second. Number two, number two, follow Saratoga left base at the freeway, runway seven left, with the option. Traffic in sight, number two, uh, number two, for seven left, fire break. Leslie, you gonna experiment with three notches? I don't know, I think I might experiment with two first. Oh, no, they're on the other one. Marshall, he's on this front one. Roger, gotcha.
So see, power off. See how I, I flow? Your power oh, that's like my best landing ever here. You guys are coming with me all the time. That was a great because landing. Because I have to, I have to impress you. You, you're a warm up here. Turn left, the scratch, come back around. That was a uh, mighty. Let that uh, Alpha Nine One Pop Sir. Thanks. Sorry. Uh, um, thank these guys. Yeah, the plane thinks it's still flying. <laughs> right? Do you see it? I, you saw when I chopped power, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You did float a little bit, but that was a beautiful. But I, I was, I was, I didn't flow up. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, thank you. Oh yeah. What a fun flight. Divide ground Sierra, Toga 3 is one pop Sierra, Alpha 9, taxi North Park. Toga 1 pop Sierra, Divide ground taxi Alpha North Park, good day. Alpha North Park, one pop Sierra, uh, yeah, one pop Sierra, good day. What's yeah. that? Those are yaks. I've flown so in they, a yak, that radio, have? yes. Are you, they, oh, they do yeah. aerials and yes. stuff? Yes, oh Nearby. my gosh. Look at all these. Let's leave Look at that 340 yeah. or whatever that thing is. Yes. 340, that, that one I'm like. That, uh, that pressurized plane? Yes. What was that like? My dad yes. was so jealous. My dad, I was, my dad was like, oh, all you have to do, you're a girl, all you have to do is walk up and be like, hey, you want to go ride the airplane?